Hey, come on. Don't don't beat yourself up, all right? Most guys I know would have assumed that Lulu was off having an affair, myself included. Oh, I was pissed off and I was hurt and I crossed the line. Valerie kissed him? Well, that's actually not I what knew happened. it. I knew after I saw that headline that girl could not be trusted. Ooh, and Nathan read me the riot act for confronting her, but who was right about this entire situation? This girl. Valerie didn't kiss Dante. But you just said that, that they kissed. Dante is the one who initiated it. I was furious, man, and I was convinced Lulu was cheating on me, and Valerie was there being all supportive. Not that that's any excuse. So, how far did things go? He was angry, and he lashed out by kissing another woman. Was that all that happened? If I say anything more, I need to know that this stays between us. Right. Of course, man. I, I wouldn't tell anybody. Not even Maxie. Yeah, that's all that happened. You're positive. Dante thought that I was sleeping with Dylan. At this point, I am lucky it was only one kiss. I cheated on my wife. And you buy that Valerie was completely blameless? I do. You are way more trusting than I am. I did my due diligence. The story that Valerie told me and Dante told me, they were identical. Oh, good for you for interrogating her. Okay, it was not an interrogation. Well, it should have been. Lulu, you were the wronged party here. I'm not the only one. What part of I lied to my husband is not sinking in? Oh, about a life or death situation that you had absolutely no control no, over. I could have controlled the way I dealt with it. If I had just been up front, none of this would have happened. Okay, you may have set these events in motion. Thank you. But I should have stopped them from getting this far. What are you talking about? Nathan and I, we came over to your place on the 4th of July. We wanted you guys to come watch the fireworks with us, but you weren't there. Dante and Valerie were alone together, and I got a really weird vibe. I shouldn't have left. It's ridiculous. I could have sat myself in between the two of them and refused to leave until Valerie went home. What? I just... I made Valerie walk me through everything that happened the night that she and Dante kissed. She never mentioned you and Nathan. You slept with Valerie. Man, a big mistake, man. And when? July 4th, after you guys left my place. I knew it. I knew something was up, man, if I just knew where your head was at. Come on, man, it's not your responsibility. It's on me and me alone. Wait, did, wait, didn't Lulu show up, like, the next day? Yes. Valerie left, Lulu got home, they barely missed each other, and then Lulu told me everything that happened. Imagine what that must have felt like. You know what that felt like? It felt like I was my father. Someone who cheats and then rationalizes it all the way. Only did this because you did that, or because you did this. But the circumstances make everything okay. Yeah, but to be fair, man, there were circumstances. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I still did something I can't take back. I did something I never thought I was even capable of doing. I did something that would destroy my wife if she ever found out. You mean she doesn't know? Oh, man, she knows we kissed. I couldn't bring myself to telling her anything else. Ruin my son's life. Man, you don't know that for a fact. Yes, I do. If Lulu found out the truth, there's no way she would forgive me. Lulu and Rock were in my world. I don't know. I don't know how I managed to forget that. But you didn't forget that. Dante, you just, you just thought that your world had changed. Either way, Rocco deserves a mother and father who love him, and Lulu and I can give him that. And I don't disagree. But? But? Are you sure you don't want to come clean? You know, I, I mean, this could be really hard in the beginning, but imagine how much better you'll feel afterwards. You know, man, I almost told her the day she came back. And I realize if she doesn't forgive me... I mean, Rocco's life is ruined. And I can't do that to him. I have to carry that myself. Then we'll find out for me. Thank you. And I'm putting you in a bad spot here. Sorry. You know, if I tell Maxie, the first thing she'll do is tell Lulu, so... <laughs> it's probably for the best. Thanks, man. I appreciate that.